Peace, man. Rock! Hang loose. Science! Huh? What was this one? It's inspired by the right hand rule. It's used in electromagnetism like that. If your electrical current goes in this direction, your magnetic field points in this direction, then your current will be diverted in this direction. It's also used in basic geometry. If you multiply two vectors like this, then your resulting vector will point this way. There's a number more applications for the right hand rule. It's a mnemonic that almost every person with a scientific background has used at some point in their life. And this is why we decided to make it the science salute. So what can you do with it? It's used to express a sudden outburst of scientific enthusiasm. Mind-blowing presentation at a conference. Cool data. If a scientist and a creationist are being asked, what, if anything, could ever change your mind? And the creationist says, nothing. And the scientist goes like, well, evidence. You go like, right on point. If someone says, if your assumption requires the deliberate suppression of information by the scientists of the world to be true, it most probably isn't. You go like, yes. If you find yourself impressed with someone's abilities to synthesize crystal meth without the use of pseudoephedrine, you go like, yes, science, bitch. Big shout out to the brilliant researchers who presented their science at the national finals of FameLab Germany in Bielefeld 2018 because it was that group who decided we need a science salute. And special mentions to Klaus Liegener who was the one to suggest using the right hand rule. Which is just so brilliant! And depending on what you want to memorize there actually also is a left hand rule. So it's scientifically absolutely accurate to go Double science! If any of you is into graphics and could make a right hand rule emoji, well, that would be. Support your local scientists. Go to the science nights, the science slams, the science cafes, the open door days at the institutes. See what those guys look like. Let them infect you with their enthusiasm for their topics. They love their science. They want to talk about their science. You want to know about science. Let's do it!